Hey guys, my name is Bhaktivala and I'm psychologist and this is my YouTube channel about psychology and also I have YouTube show about uh, inspiration with the different guests from different fields. Uh, in uh, I wanted to sorry for my English in advance because I didn't have a, a practice for a long time, but I will try my best. My channel is in Russian uh, and I do psychological videos in Russian, but I don't think that I'm ready to speak about psychology in English, so that is why I, s I decided to start from the vlog yeah, about my life. I think I have a quite interesting life. <laughs> Okay, uh, I just moved to Georgia. It's um, one of the post-Soviet Union countries. I moved from Almaty, Kazakhstan, and I'm 28 years old. I'm psychologist and I'm working online. And uh, also I have autoimmune disease uh, with which I live like about uh, 18 years. And it's a, lit a very hard life to live with disease. I think I'm not ready to make videos about psychology in English. That is why I decided to, to make this vlog about my life. I think it's quite interesting to know the life of the psychologist. And the, of course, I think as, as, I think as every person thinks, I have a very interesting life. I moved to Georgia uh, this about um, 20 days ago. From Kazakhstan, I'm from Almaty, it's in Kazakhstan. So this vlog will be on topics about psychology, of course, because it's my main topic and about traveling, about room tours and about moving to another country. I think it's a great experience to share with someone and especially about Georgia. Um, and I, will, I live now in Tbilisi. I think uh, a lot of people heard about this place because it's very comfortable for living. I have an autoimmune disease, it's called ulcerative colitis um, and I think I will cover a little bit about this topic also because it's important for me uh, to inspire people with autoimmune diseases to live their life fullest. Yeah, in the, in the most popular question that I have from my friends and uh, from people whom I met here is why I moved to Georgia. Uh, yeah, I moved to Georgia because it uh, was uh, one of the best spots <laughs> near the Kazakhstan. I, I couldn't afford like financially and uh, with my health conditions to move to Europe or USA or even to tropic uh, countries as every people do, like uh, live in Bali, in Thailand or Vietnam. I cannot afford it with my health conditions because I took medicine and I needed to transfer it to the country where I will live and the Georgia seemed to me the easiest way to live because in Georgia you can live one year without visa and any permission and also I choose Georgia because uh, my English <laughs> I think my English is not so good and uh, uh, I, I, fe I felt myself more comfortable where people can speak also Russian and uh, mm, of course they speak mas mas mostly in Georgian but they also speak Russian because we all lived in, post uh, in Soviet Union and we all people from post-Soviet uh, Union countries we speak Russian but not young generation here but uh, anyway people understand Russian and also I wanted to practice my English um, and the, a lot of uh, people from different countries countries live in Tbilisi because they have this uh, good uh, tax um, very ta good tax rules and so a lot of people prefer uh, open here their businesses and also it's uh, like a spot for digital nomads who live here because they uh, they earn in dollars and in euros and in Georgia it's a lorry uh, and it's really comfortable and cheap to live here also it's about climate conditions uh, here is very comfortable you know like uh, there, now it's April it's um, end of the April and the temperature is very comfortable it's not uh, hot yet but it's okay yeah it's a little bit windy but not hot and not cold but i think it will be hotter soon <laughs> I, but it's okay and there is there is a lot of places to travel because of um, tourism that's very 
uh, developed here. You can travel like to any city, like a Kutaisi or Kazbegi, like a two or three or four hours by the bus or by taxi or you can rent a car. Yeah, and also I created this video to explain to my followers from Instagram why I'm not in Instagram. I came to Georgia <laughs> like 20 days, 20 and um, maybe 23 days ago and uh, it's like uh, almost one week I didn't uh, go sit in Instagram because I'm so tired. Uh, it's really hard to move to another country and uh, you know uh, when I came here, it was really hard to find a flat for rent because of the war conditions in Ukraine. A lot of Russian people immigrated to Georgia, of course, because of these good conditions. And there is was the, the prices for flats and everything just uh, went up. It is really expensive now here. So I was really stressed to searching this flat. And before I was leaving to Georgia, it's like one, uh, one week left before my leaving from Kazakhstan. Uh, my mom, she had an epilepsy and uh, she burned half of her body. And it was so stressful for me. And when I came here in Georgia on the third day, I recognized that my grandmother, she had an infarct. I don't know how it's called. It's a heart attack. Yeah, yeah, it's a heart attack. And I was really <laughs> stressed again. So, and also my health conditions a little bit uh, get wrong. And it, I, I didn't... I didn't know what to feel and I was really confused and I really tired so that is why I decided to switch uh, to skip the Instagram things but um, maybe it was not good decision because you know I'm working as a psychologist and I'm writing posts about about psychology in, not only in Instagram but in Telegram also but uh, for me, uh, my mental health, my mental stability is very important. And I have a client, I have group uh, psychology things. That is why I decided that uh, Instagram is not important for me now. But I will be back soon, I promise. And Instagram is very important for me in general. But these days I understood that it's really hard to sit there. Yeah. But anyway, I really like the Georgia. I love to live here, even it's like a 23 days, but it's my third time here. And I really enjoy time here. And uh, there will be some videos uh, of the Tbilisi city, it's the capital of the Georgia. And you can enjoy and ask your questions in the comments below of this video. Um, and I will do more videos about traveling around the Georgia and uh, how it looks like to live in Georgia. Also, I want to cover uh, topics about um, traveling and uh, how to date here, how to live here and uh, like room tours. And you see like I'm shooting in the old uh, Georgian flat and I really like it because uh, yeah, the design is really, really nice. And I think I will cover the topic about how to be a psychologist because I think it's very interesting. Uh, when I meet people, they're always asking me, uh, what is my job? And I say, ah, I'm a psychologist. They say, wow, what is it? <laughs> what is it? How do you feel? You're analyzing me. What are you doing? So I want to, like, to show you how like, um, psychologists maybe live. Not every psychologist that my life i think it's very interesting so thank you for watching um, continue watching about the georgia the Tbilisi city and the smash the like button and the follow button and the thank you for watching Swear I won't forget this Why do I regret this? In my mind reckless Thoughts are feeling endless Sitting up I'm breathless Anxiety's infectious I feel so defenseless Betrayed and embarrassed I hate being open I hate being broken I feel like an ocean Filled up with emotion Anger ain't a potion Rub it on like lotion I can feel it soaking Reopen the scars have awoken I can't move on till I let go I feel so lost, never at home 
Need to be strong every breath hold Cause I can't move on till I let go I can't move on till I let go I feel so lost never at home Need to be strong every breath hold Cause I can't move on till I let go Cause I can't move on till I let go